Effects of density altitude will get brought up on your private pilot check ride, so here's a complete ground lesson. Pressure altitude is the altitude your altimeter would read if set to 29.92 inches of mercury. Density altitude is just pressure altitude corrected for non-standard temperature. When the air is warm, humid, or the pressure is low, the air molecules are spread further apart, so the air gets less dense. High density altitude means thin air. Low density altitude means thicker air. Think of it as density altitude is what the aircraft thinks it's at. If you have a density altitude of 10,000 feet when you're at sea level, that's really high density altitude and your aircraft would perform as if it's flying at 10,000 feet. So on a hot day at a mountainous airport, your airplane's gonna perform as if it's at thousands of feet higher than the elevation of the airport. So why does density altitude matter? First one is engine performance. Piston engines need oxygen to burn the fuel. Thin air means less oxygen, which then means less power. Number two is wing lift. Wings generate lift by air molecules being deflected downward. Fewer molecules mean less lift at any given airspeed. The airplane has to accelerate to a higher true airspeed to reach the same indicated airspeed needed for takeoff. And number three is propeller thrust. A propeller is like an airfoil. So thin air over your propeller means less thrust. Then we have the factors that affect density altitude. Number one is gonna be elevation. The higher you go, the less dense the air becomes. Number two is temperature. Hot air expands and gets thinner. And number three, we have humidity. Water vapor displaces the air molecules so the air becomes less dense. Hot, high, and humid means high density altitude. These are gonna affect things like your takeoff performance, longer takeoff roll because you need more airspeed to create enough lift. Slower acceleration, engines and propellers are gonna be less efficient. And you also have a reduced climb gradient because you have less power available for the climb. This could be really dangerous if you have to clear obstacles. That's why it's so important to know your density altitude and know the performance of your aircraft before you take off.